It's impressive. U.S. sees Ukraine's successes on battlefield. Congresswoman. The United States of America is impressed that Ukraine has managed to liberate more than half of the occupied territories that Russia has seized since the start of the full-scale invasion, says the member of the House of Representatives, Abigail Spanberger, at a press conference in Kyiv. As Spanberger noted, she is proud that the American people support and invest in Ukraine and its fight against Russian aggression. She is also looking forward to continuing this support. We have seen the successes of Ukraine as Ukraine has won back more than 50% of the land that Russia has taken since their invasion two years ago. This is impressive, said the Congresswoman. On February the 9th, a delegation of American congressmen, including both Democrats and Republicans, arrived in Kyiv. The delegation was led by the House of Intelligence Chair, a member of the Republican House of Representatives, Mike Turner. In particular, the delegation included Republican French Hill, Democrat Abigail Spanberger, Republican Zach Nunn. Spanberger, a Henrico County resident and a member of the House of Permanent Select Intelligence Committee, has criticized Republican opposition that killed a proposed $118 billion aid package in the U.S. Senate this week that would have included $60 billion in U.S. aid to Ukraine. The Senate is now considering a $95 billion package in aid for Ukraine, Israel, Gaza and priorities in the Indo-Pacific region. Members held a news conference in Kyiv to show support for Ukraine. To the Ukrainian people, thank you for welcoming us on this trip. Spanberger said during the news conference, according to a transcript her office provided. As my colleagues have stated, the purpose and the goal of this trip is to ensure that our Ukrainian partners recognize the commitment that the American people and certainly the American Congress will continue to have in supporting Ukraine in its fight for freedom.